everyone, today I'm going to be doing the Vampire Diaries tag and I saw Ingrid or Miss Glamorazzi and Joey Graceffa do this video. They just posted it, they made up this tag and yeah, I will link their videos down below if you would like to see. They did like a video together and then split it up and put it on both channels. Yeah, but so I am a huge Vampire Diaries fan from the beginning and yeah, I just thought that I would do this tag. I mean, I kind of felt like I had to. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and get into it. So, and sorry, I'm trying to figure out which... No, definitely this side. Okay. Sorry. Number one, how did you discover the show? I can't really remember for this one. Um, like, Joey and Ingrid, they had a specific answer, but they were, a f like... They were quite a bit behind on the show, but I had been watching it ever since it first premiered. Like, I saw the first episode on the night that it premiered, I think, unless it was recorded and I couldn't watch it that night, but yeah. So, I think I was probably watching something else on the CW, because that's the channel that it airs on. I was probably watching America's Next Top Model, and then it probably came on as a commercial or whatever, like after America's Next Top Model ended. But yeah, I've been watching it ever since. I don't even remember when it started or what se um, what season they're on, but it started a long time ago because I've watched, like I have the first season or something on DVD and it's changed so much. Like even just the filming style and like the quality of it has improved so much. So. Yeah, I discovered it probably just through watching TV or the media or something. I don't know. Number two, who's your favorite character? And this one is kind of difficult because all of the characters are amazing. Like, I really, really, really like all of the characters. I would probably say that Damon is probably my favorite character. And I'll mention him a lot through all of these questions, but I just really, really, really like his personality. He's kind of like the bad boy, but he also like genuinely loves Elena and would really do anything to protect her and to save her. So I don't know, like he's really sweet, but he's also got that bad boy edge where if something needs to be done, he's not afraid to do it when other people are scared to do things because they might not be like acceptable. So yeah, I also really, really, really liked Alaric before he became a vampire. Sorry. <laughs> there may be spoilers in here if you guys haven't watched, but um, I really like Alaric's character. He's he's different, and he's kind of like Damon. He's kind of like a go-getter. Like, he's going to go do these things, and I don't know. I just like seeing him stand up, and also because he looks after Elena, and he's kind of like the parental unit, I guess. I don't know. He's like the parent for them. Number three, if you were a vampire, would you live off of human or animal blood? Definitely human blood. Um, I, ever since I've gotten into vampire shows, I've wanted to be a vampire so bad. Like, if that could happen, oh my god, I would like, I don't know, I don't want to get into this too much, but like, if a vampire was in the school or something, I would like sacrifice myself and be like, take me now. Like, turn me, please, please, please. Um, so, yeah. It's kind of ironic, though, because I am super, super, super scared of, like, blood and stuff. But if I could live forever, I could deal with it. I mean, I'd have plenty of time to get over that. So, definitely human blood. Just because animal blood, I feel like you would have to kill more to satisfy yourself off of animal blood. Especially if you're drinking blood out of small animals. Than to just either... This sounds so, like, so bad, but then to either just, like, drink off of a human but not kill them or to just get the blood bags. So, yes. Number four, Team Stefan or Damon. No question there. Team Damon all the way. All the, all the, all the way. Like, hands down. It, there's no question in my mind. Yeah, Stefan was good in the beginning, but even then he was boring and he's so like depressing and just like eh, I hate my life and he he's just no he's boring Damon is a lot 
hotter. Like, come on, he is way more attractive. And, I don't know, he's just more protective of Elena. Yes. Number five, what's your favorite supernatural power? I would probably, well, out of the, all of the supernatural things, there's vampires, witches, and, oh my god, what else is there? Werewolves. Definitely not a werewolf. I would definitely say vampire out of all of them because I just love the fact that they can literally, like, run super fast and that they can also compel people. And I know that's kind of like a evil thing to say, but I think it's really cool that they can like basically tell people what to do. I think that's pretty cool. Being a witch would be cool, but I'd rather be a vampire, so yeah. Number six, if you were to be a character, who would you be? Now, obviously, I'm going to choose a girl character, but I would, I don't know. This one is hard because there's a lot of good girl characters. I, I want to say Elena, but she's gone through so much, like, bad stuff that I don't know if I would be able to go through that. I think Caroline's pretty awesome, but I also really like Rebecca. I would probably say I would be Rebecca because she's kind of like, she's kind of like, she's like a bad girl, but she's also, she also has like her weakness and she shows that she's also sweet and nice, I guess. As sweet and nice as a vampire can be, but I don't know, I just like her complexity, so yes. Number seven, have you read the book series? No, I have not. Somehow I just haven't been interested in them whatsoever, but I bet they're good. Number eight, who is your crush on the show? Definitely Damon, Ian Summerholder. Oh my god. How can someone be that gorgeous? I don't understand. But really all of the cast is gorgeous. Klaus, oh god, what, who plays him? I can't, I can't think of what the actor's name is, but he's pretty gorgeous too. Number nine, what was your first or initial thought of the show and did it change after you saw it? I would say that as it goes on, I'm becoming more and more obsessed with it and more drawn into it and more into it, I guess. In the beginning, I knew that I would love it because I had already loved vampire type things, but there weren't as many out. It was coming out around the time when Twilight was pretty big, so vampire things were like coming in at that time. I have definitely loved it more as it goes on and I've become really obsessed with it like I don't know what I'll do once it ends it's gonna be a really 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 bad day but I would I would say that in the beginning it was a little more like cheesy and kind of the way that it was set up and the way that they acted obviously has grown as they've grown as becoming better actors but now it's just more intense and I really really like it a lot more now and then number 10 who is your favorite villain and it's it's wow that was great it's kind of hard um in Ingrid and Joey's video they said that like the villain eventually becomes like their ally or like the good guy and Damon was like a really bad boy in the beginning and he was a really bad villain but obviously I love him now Klaus he's also a great villain because He's, he's been their enemy through the whole entire thing, but he kind of softened up towards the end, and then he, um, so, yeah. And now that Alaric is a vampire, he is a huge villain. He is, like, out to get everyone, all of the vampires, and, yeah, I really, really, really like Alaric's character. He's just an awesome character I think so yes I hope you all enjoyed this video please make sure to either leave a video response down below or just the answers to your question in a comment an answer to your question an answer to the question in a comment below and yeah please tell me any other tag videos that you would like me to do because I really like doing tags so yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video and that you are having a fantastic day. Oh wow, I have nice lines now. But yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye everyone!